G'day and welcome to another video with BetterPix. Hope this finds you all well. Today we're going to have a look at how to copy and paste edit settings within Lightroom Classic. Now there's a couple of ways that you can do this and both of them are pretty quick and easy. So let's see how we do it just to help speed up our workflow a little bit. All right, we've got an image here. We're in the library at the moment. We're going to pop over to the develop module and you can see I've got all the images in thumbnails at the bottom here. Now with the image that you're looking at at the moment, we have applied some edits to them. Uh, not a huge amount. The image was uh, fairly correct uh, shot within camera, but so we've just added some contrast and saturation and a little bit of an exposure adjustment as well. There's a couple of ways that we can uh, copy and paste those settings to a different image. First one, we're just going to right click and you can see there's uh, develop settings there. You can copy settings and you can check all or check none or you can check individual uh, exposure uh, adjustments. Then of course you hit copy, head over to a different image and hit paste. And those adjustments will be pasted to that image. Now the other way that we can do it is uh, once we have our primary image selected, we can then select our secondary image. You can see that this tab changes from previous to sync. So we're just going to hit sync. And again, we've got the option to uh, sync uh, specific uh, parameters. Just going to hit synchronize. And then those parameters are applied to that other image. There we go. Now, obviously these images aren't going to be exactly the same and they're going to require different edit settings, but for demonstration purposes, that's how you do it. As with Lightroom and Adobe Camera Raw, these methods will definitely help to speed up your workflow and make things just work more efficiently, particularly when you've got a large number of images uh, to get through. If you've been traveling and you've been shooting a lot of images, it can really help the speed that uh, you get through your image editing, which is never a bad thing. Thanks very much for stopping by. I hope you've enjoyed this video and we look forward to seeing you next time. As always, any questions are welcome in the comments below. Take care.